I'm not even gonna start the video with an intro or anything. I just wanna flat out say this is probably the largest Call of Duty League I've ever seen in my entire 10 years of playing Call of Duty and in like nine years of making YouTube videos. Um, this league that I'm gonna talk to you guys about again um, is definitely gonna make a lot of people mad at the higher ups at Activision and uh, Treyarch because a lot of stuff about the game is gonna be leaked out within the next coming days here. So um, if you guys don't know what happened, basically, over over on um, Reddit and Twitter, um, Call of Duty Modern Warzone, Doug Dagnabbit and his team, which consists of the Game Revolution, DK Dynamite, and a couple of other people, were able to find this website. Um, it was called like PS4 Patch or something like that. I'm gonna have a link to it down below in the description, and of course there are articles as well. But um, on that website, there is like a little patch for Call of Duty 2020. But now what the developers are gonna do is name or title the patch of the game and also give it an image with just something completely and totally different to throw off suspicion that you know hey this patch on this website is actually related to a brand new AAA Call of Duty title that hasn't even been released yet um, but as to why they have this website up for the public instead of something a bit more private um, is beyond me I guess it's for you know the people to just like kind of go back in uh, in the past and see what patches were uh, updated for what game and whatnot but I'm not sure why they would even upload it to this website i'm sure there's a reason to it um but the reason why they may have to use this website to upload these patches is because the developers and um, qa testers are probably working from home due to covid19 and this is the only way they can you know actually update and play call of duty 2020 when you know they're working on the game or testing it whatever um but again i'm not sure why it has to you know be public but there might be some logical reasoning behind it i, I just i can't think of a reason why though but but, um, guys, the reason why this is going to be the largest leak is because data miners are going to figure out, you know, stuff about this game. They're going to get insight about it and they're going to figure out, um, you know, stuff regarding the campaign and the multiplayer possibly. Um, zombies and just so so much more like little details about the campaign major plot points um, multiplayer weapons like the entire game could almost be spoiled and we already have an image for the logo of the game already I'm gonna have a link to it down below obviously I cannot post it due to copyright reasons and I would not recommend you guys doing so either on Twitter or on YouTube because um, Activision is definitely gonna take down your account um, but yeah guys just be ready for the next few days a lot of stuff is gonna get spoiled for Call of Duty 2020 and I'm not talking about like a little image or something. I'm talking about like um, weapons and, you know, like I said, the campaign plot. Um, if, if there's zombies and just so, so much more. Again, guys, all the links are going to be down below in the description. Um, full credit goes out to Modern War Zone, The Gaming Revolution, DK Dynamite for discovering this. Um, a link to their stuff is going to be in there as well. And yeah, honestly, guys, just be ready for something big to happen next week if the leaks, you know, don't already um, spoil the game. Uh, but I definitely do think next week is going to be the time when Call of Duty 2020 is going to be revealed because usually whenever like a big leak or, or something like that happens, um, Activision and Treyarch will, will jump on that and, you know, say, hey, like, here's our game already. Haha, <laughs> we, we kind of, you know, we're planning this all along just so the game wouldn't be spoiled, you know, uh, weeks before we plan on doing a launch or something like that. So um, I expect next week to at least, you know, have some kind of a reveal for Call of Duty 2020, whether, whether that's in-game for Warzone or just you know something online like I, I don't know what what's gonna happen but I definitely do think next week is gonna be huge for Call of Duty 2020 so that's gonna be it for the video guys um, thanks for watching love y'all so so much comment down below your thoughts and I'll see you all later